Hey John here. I've got Zeke's uh, 500 Magnum, uh, which you guys know Zeke. He's you know you see him on the Gun Culture Radio podcast occasionally. He's from SDI, which is our sponsor. They're an online accredited gunsmithing college. You can check them out at sdi.edu. They take, take GI Bill. Really cool opportunity. But because of him, I got this thing, and uh, well, we got two rounds in it because you know I'm kind of a wuss and I'm kind of scared of it. It's pretty intimidating, but you know why not? I'm gonna shoot a two liter and see what happens. The tendency on these things is to pull them down because the recoil is, is um, it's, it's, the recoil is strong, obviously. <laughs> so, but I'll try not to do that. Like I said, the tendency is definitely to pull these things down, which is exactly what I did. And uh, I haven't shot with these in a long time, so that's my excuse. I'm gonna get a couple more rounds though and attempt to redeem myself. Got some uh, Magtex over here. These are only about $8 per shot. All right, I feel a little better about it now that I, that I fired it. I have to say, you know, as much as this gun kicks, it's actually not quite as bad, really, as the 454 Casol with the really hot ammo. Um, you know, it's got that nice, um, you know, porting on the end of the barrel and stuff, so. All right, try something else. Get the cowboy. Looks like it needs a 500 Magnum. Uh, I'm gonna try for the big propane tank over there. Probably like a little low. I think I got it that time. All right, I'm gonna shoot the gong. Uh, I can't tell if I hit it or not. All right, this thing's a beast, and uh, I'm off to the hospital to uh, fix my wrist. Talk to you guys later.